Hello and welcome back to my Nearport series. And uh, if you're just joining uh, this lesson, um, we've already gone past um, creating um, the account on Nearport. So we're basically um, far into the tutorials and I'll, I'll recommend you go through uh, the previous videos first. Uh, in this video, we're just going to look at the activity um, for the additional activities here on Nearport. We've already covered time to climb, matching pairs, and also um, was draw it, yeah. So I'm going to show you open-ended question in this video. So with open-ended question, all you're simply doing is um, creating an open-ended open question. So you can say discuss the last lesson or summarize Let's see. Summarize your experience in three hundred in less than three hundred, or let's just say less than one hundred words. Okay. You can add an image if you want. If you want the students to record, you can do that, and you can also set a time limit to it. And that's basically it with uh, open-ended questions. And uh, I'll just show you how to create. Uh, quizzes as well within your lesson you just simply click on add new scroll down of course for more and you've got a quiz and with quiz of course you've got multiple um, just multiple choice questions uh, so what is your name I'm just so say Bob and Sarah of course if you want to add more answers you can click on this i'll just leave it at two and i can add more questions and i'll say uh, how old are you and i'll just put some random numbers um, and add another answer just so you see how this is used and i'll choose anyone and that's basically it uh, for any question you want to add uh, addition, uh, maybe an image or audio you can do that here just click on it and you've got these options here you can include web web content as well uh, for image of course you can just search on line and you'll see it will give you all of this you just simply add in it's there and the students just see the image there if you're asking a question with reference to the image that would be very good as well yeah you just simply see what is the image display or what are different parts of something and so on and so forth and you can name your quiz at the top and i'll just say test here and that's it and of course you can time the entire quiz using um at the top using the timer at the top okay so i'll just save so this will be the quiz feature and the open-ended uh question feature okay so the video will I'll be ending the video here.